Hello everybody, this is Aaron from Two Lads Garage. This is just going to be a real quick video. I'm going to show you a method that I used on these seats I got out of the junkyard. Seats are pretty hard to find. Unfortunately, the person that had them before me smoked. So there's some cigarette burns in them. But I'm trying a method that I honestly didn't think would work. And I thought it worked reasonably well on a scale of 1 to 5. I'd give it a 4. So it's quick, it's easy, it's cheap. And it saved these seats. So... Hopefully, it'll help you as much as it helped me. I'll tell you on a side note, that is one tough camera. It's taken many a spills and it's glued together, but it works. Anyway, to speak of glue, I'm going to use my old go-to E6000. I'm going to squirt some down this hole, wherever the cigarette burn is. Take some of this tufts, just stick it in there. Alright, so while I was editing the video, I realized I never told y'all where I was getting the fuzzies from. Alright, so the back of the seat has this more carpet textured fabric on it. And it's not hard at all to pull some of the tufts off. And you get the fuzzies, and that's why I use to patch the seat. That's not a perfect fix, but it ain't bad. Let's see, another little spot right here. Let's put another little dab of glue down. Ooh, I don't want to put it like that, just like this. See, and there's another bad one up here on the headrest. See, and another tuft or two of fuzz. I wasn't planning on it, but I might put this on a separate video just because somebody might be helped by it. They don't want to watch me get a truck ready for power tour, they just want to get cigarette burns out of seats. Is that perfect? No, but heck, that's a lot better. All right, well, I'm going to go around here and fix a few more cigarette burns. But, um, surprisingly, this method worked. I'm, I'm honestly a little shocked. All right, so the conclusion. That burn was all the way through. Like I said, it's not perfect. So is that one. But, heck of an improvement. We also have one up here on the headrest. I do need to trim the fuzzies off because that is a little different texture, but that's also a massive improvement. This was probably the worst one right here. And, eh. Well, there you have it. Some E6000 and some of the fuzzies off the back. And I thought this did a reasonably good job. These seats, like I said, are not easy to find. And so when I found some, they're reasonably good shape. I had to save them. I did the experimentation, so you don't have to. Again, I used E6000 glue to get that stuff anywhere. I don't see the tube right now. I'd show you it's silver. So anyway, if you enjoyed this, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, hit a thumbs up, share it with a friend, do all that other good stuff. That'll help me bring you more useful tricks and tidbits. Try to save y'all some money, save y'all some headaches. But until next time, take care of yourself, take care of each other. God bless, and I'll see you soon.